Channel 2 News begins right now with a breaking news alert. That breaking news coming to us from Waller County where a deputy was killed in a crash. We have just learned that deputy who died is Lauren Vasquez. Channel 2's Kathy Hernandez has been following this story for us all morning and joins us live from Walker County with the latest. Kathy, our hearts go out the department. Absolutely, there are heavy hearts here in Waller County this morning. As you said it just minutes ago, the department released the name of the fallen deputy. They say she is 23 year old deputy Lauren Vasquez. As you can see here, the flags are flying at half staff this morning. Deputy Vasquez was a rookie and joined the department back in May. She had just completed her 20 week field training program. They say last night was her third night on patrol alone. Earlier this morning, a community member left flowers for Vasquez outside the sheriff's office as again flags are flying at half staff. Overnight, a very powerful moment as officers stood in salute as they loaded their colleague into an ambulance outside Memorial Hermann Hospital in Cyprus. Then officers in their patrol cars escorted the ambulance as it carried Vasquez's body to the Harris County Medical Examiner's Office. The sheriff says the 23-year-old rookie deputy was responding to a high water rescue call late last night. He says she went off the roadway, rolled her patrol car into a flooded area on FM 362 at Hoover and became trapped in water. Rescuers couldn't save her. Even after emergency crews were gone, the ditches were full of water. Now community members are remembering her. I know there's a lot of pain and we have a, a really great sheriff, a great team behind him. And, uh, I just feel their pain today. I want God to be with them, to bless them, for healing, for strength. And this morning, Sheriff Glenn Smith wrote on Facebook, words will never express what our office is going through, and we can only ask for your prayers. It goes on to say, know that the blue line has heartfelt tears on it for our office. Again, just minutes ago, the department released the name of the deputy killed late last night. She is 23-year-old Deputy Lauren Vasquez. Of course, we'll continue to keep the department in our thoughts and prayers. Reporting live in Waller County, Kathy Hernandez, KPRC, Channel 2 News. We